So those are things they are important in the God that I am worshiping or or that I want to worship. Those together, all of these explanation means al qayyum So Allah La ilaha illa huwa means Allah is the only God who deserves to be worshipped. He is Al Hay Al Qayyum. Al Hay, you already know it, and now you know Al Qayyum. Al Qayyum. So, so actually, if if we read the explanation of Quran in other languages, we will not find this. We will just find it simple. But today we are learning this to realize how big. How big and valuable is the meaning of this ayah? Now, the second part, la ta'khuduhu sinatun wa la naw. Now, what is the different the difference between sinah and naw? If you ask some some Arab brothers here, they will say it is the same. Maybe, maybe I'm not sure. But actually, there is big difference. Imagine if. Oh. Okay. Uh, when it is the time for praying, <coughs> we will take the break. It is, I think, 15 minutes later. Now, لا تأخذه سنة ولا نوم means in general that that Allah never sleep. But now we will explain. Another thing we need, or another thing I need with the God that I'm going to worship, is that He shouldn't have anything makes Him weak. When you, when you fall asleep, you become weak. And when you are sleeping, you are very weak. Now imagine if God has to take a rest. Then if he is taking a rest, who will be holding the sky not to fall down on the earth? This is an example. See how Allah is generous to us. No matter you believe or disbelieve in Allah, no matter you are respecting Allah or disrespecting Allah, no matter you are fighting for the sake of Allah or you are fighting for the sake of Satan, Allah still tells you, you sleep. And I will stay awake keeping your heart working. Keeping your breathing working. Imagine if every one of us needs to have an employee 
to make his heart working while he is sleeping. No, actually, Allah says, you sleep, and I will take care of your heart. You sleep, and I will take care of your breathing. You sleep, and I will take care of your blood, will be running in the right way. So, this God should be able to keep on controlling and keep an eye on everything without feeling tired at all. Now, now means deep sleeping. Sina means to think, to start the first feeling of needing a sleep. So this means that Allah never fall asleep and it never comes to him that maybe it is nice to sleep. This function or this option is 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 not there, is not exist. So this is to give us an idea how merciful Allah is. This is why He is Rahman, if you remember last week. Because He is sending His mercy upon everyone, believers and disbelievers, but only in this life. And why only in this life? To prove to us or to teach us that this life means nothing. And, and, and deserves nothing. It is only the place to build the paradise. Remember this again and again. Now, Allah is the only one who deserves to be worshipped. And He was never born and He will never die and He is exist since ever. And He is taking care of everybody, able to give everybody everything without losing anything. And He never falls asleep and He never thinks of sleeping. After all of this, I know that God has all of these things so far. But I still need more things in the God that I'm going to worship. This thing is that He must be the owner of everything. Like when I say that I want one million US dollar, for example, that he will not say that no, I don't deal with US dollar. For example, so he must be the owner of everything. And owner means controller. 
and everything, everything means everything in the earth and in the sky and in the global. Is it the time for praying? Okay, so ten minutes break. Inshallah.